How's it going today guys? My name is Ethan and welcome to Rapture. And we are back in Assassin's Creed 1 today where we're continuing on with the main story. Uh, we are now in Jerusalem. I have done bits and pieces of the viewpoints, leaving one because I can't be bothered. And we're going to do the three investigation missions, which I'm already at the eavesdropping one, which is there. And then we're going to continue on with the assassination. So, let's get started. I am sorry, Ahmad. It came without warning. My son? They have my son? What is to be done with him? We did everything we could. What is to be done with him? He's to be executed. Today. No. I won't allow it. But what can we do? Majduddin will hear no appeals. He says there can be no barter with God's will. This is not God's will, but madness. I'll go to him myself. Where is he? He will attend the execution. Perform it even. He enjoys the act. Truly evil man. We have no time to lose then. Let's go. Alright, so that guy's gonna go save his son. But I don't think we're going to do anything about it. Like, I wouldn't be surprised if Altea just stood there and watched it happen and then assassinated him afterwards. I can't be bothered. I was like, if I can air assassinate him, then yeah, but I think those people were meant to be like harder enemies that you were meant to, meant to actually fight. We are only human. We might halt. We might Sorry, fail. Majduddin is here to see that even when this happens, we are returned to a proper course. Confess to him, and he will show mercy. But should you try to run, to hide, you will be found and made to pay. There is no harm in naming them. Those among you who defy the law. We are nothing without our faith. Without its rules and its direction. To defy it is to defy the one who leads us. Such behavior cannot be allowed. So from the sound of it, this guy uses religion to... Just enforce his own Most. He seems a bit too righteous. Is the law really so important to him? What do you think? I think he hides something, and I think you'll tell me what it is. It's a veil. All of it. Men like me, we are meant to scare them, fill the people with fear. The ones he kills, not criminals, but dangerous all the same. Dangerous to who? His plans. Their plans. Yes, he speaks of others. Those he works with. Works for, perhaps. I am uncertain. They need the city, though. Controlling it is important to them. Why? You'll have to ask him yourself. Attend one of his executions. It's when he's most talkative, addressing the crowd, hands covered in blood. Then we are done. We said, yeah, all right. One pickpocket, easy one. 
Here's dropping in pickpockets, the easier ones, oh. which they, like, you finish them in like 10 seconds, 30 seconds. See the order. He wants us to repair a stage for another execution today. It's the one at the western edge of Solomon's temple. I was on my way just now. So much death. Worried that our true leader might return and bring a measure of justice to this city. Yes, and not this mockery Mitch the Dean parades before us. How? How does something like this happen? Everyone appointed in Salah Adin's stead is met with an untimely end. And now the position falls to him. He, who was once nothing more than the Emir's scribe. How convenient. It would not surprise me to learn he was behind these accidents. Shh! If the guards hear us, we'll be taken for treason. Executed on the very platform we have to repair. Come, let us return to work. killing like 10 people and pickpocketing we're done. Now we can go actually do the assassination. What have I done wrong? Help me! Die, please! Okay, we can go this way and jump down. Alright, awesome. Oh shit. Shit. No, you don't understand. I have nothing. Would you please get Do you think he's the chief? You dare steal in my presence? 
That will cost you your life! Consume the land! And thousands of lives are lost in its defense! You are in the tragedy! But I say, this is an honor! What news, novice? I am not a novice. A man's skill is defined by his actions, not the markings on his robe. We can trade barbs or do El Muallim's work. It's your decision. Then be out with it. Al Muallim has asked that Mejduddin be slain. He is to hold a public execution not far from here. It's sure to be well guarded, but nothing I can't handle. I know what to do. And that is why you remain a novice in my eyes. You cannot know anything. Only suspect. You must expect to be wrong. To have overlooked something. Anticipate, Altair. How many times must I remind you of this? Are we done? Not quite. There is one more thing. One of the men to be executed is a brother. One of us. Al Mulim wishes for him to be saved. Do not worry about the actual rescue. My men will take care of that. But you must ensure Majduddin does not take his life. Alright then. That sounds easy enough. Don't foul this, Altair. Time is of the essence. Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. Jerusalem, hear me well. I stand here today to deliver a warning. There are malcontents among you. They sow the seeds of discontent, hoping to lead you astray. Tell me, is this what you desire? To be mired in deceit and sin? To live your lives in fear? Then you wish to take action? Your devotion pleases me. This evil must be purged. Only then can we hope to be redeemed. This is not justice. You do all right to do that. Who do you take yourself for? And all of you stand idle, complicit in this crime. Look, curse you are! Oh. See how the evil of one man spreads to corrupt others? They sought to instill fear and doubt within you. 
but I will keep you safe. Here now are four filled with sin. The harlot, the thief, the gambler, the heretic. Let God's judgment be brought down upon them all! She goes by many names, but her sin remains the same. She turned her back on the teachings of the defile her Kill him! Your work here is finished. No, no! It had only just begun. Tell me, what's your part in all of this? Do you intend to defend yourself as the others have and explain away your evil deeds? The Brotherhood wanted the city. I wanted power. There was an opportunity. An opportunity to murder innocents. Not so innocent. Dissident voices cut deep as steel. They disrupt order. In this, I do agree with the Brotherhood. You'd kill people simply for believing differently than you. Of course not. I killed them because I could. Because it was fun. Do you know what it feels like to determine another man's fate? And did you see the way that people cheered? The way they feared me? I was like a god. You'd have done the same if you could. Such power. Once, perhaps. But then I learned what becomes of those who lift themselves above others. And what is that? Here, let me show you. All right, time to run. <laughs> Get out of the way, Randos. Come on, guys, bring it. Seriously? Hurry up and fight me. Ah! <laughs> 
Now I bet you we're gonna get back and he's gonna be like, you made a public assassination again. You were just not good enough. Jerusalem needs a new ruler. So I have heard. What's this? No words of wisdom for me? Surely I have failed in some spectacular fashion. You performed as an assassin should. No more, no less. That you expect praise for merely doing as told, however, troubles me. It seems everything I do troubles you. Reflect on that. But do so on your way back to Masyaf. Your work here is done. Fast-forwarding memory to a more recent one. All right, one more. Well, now, I think in general there's like four more. Take your time when moving slowly. Come, Altair. I would have news of your progress. I've done as you've asked. Good, good. I sense your thoughts are elsewhere. Speak your mind. Each man I'm sent to kill speaks cryptic words to me. Each time I come to you and ask for answers. Each time you give only riddles in exchange. But no more. Who are you to say no more? I'm the one who does the killing. If you want it to continue, you'll speak straight with me for once. Tread carefully, boy. I do not like your tone. And I do not like your deception. I have offered you a chance to restore your lost honor. Not lost. Taken. By you. And then you've sent me to fetch it again like some damn dog. It seems I'll need to find another. A shame. You showed great potential. I think if you had another, you'd have sent him long ago. You said the answer to my question would arise when I no longer needed to ask it. So I will not ask. I demand you tell me what binds these men. Now, what you say is true. These men are connected by a blood oath not unlike our own. Who are they? Non nobis, domine non nobis. Templars. Now you see the true reach of Robert de Sade. All of these men, leaders of cities, commanders of armies, all pledge allegiance to his cause. Their works are not meant to be viewed on their own, are they? But as a whole, what do they desire? Conquest. They seek the Holy Land not in the name of God, but for themselves. What of Richard? Salah Eddin. Any who oppose the Templars will be destroyed. Be assured they have the means to accomplish it. Then they must be stopped. That is why we do our work, Altair. To ensure a future free of such things. Why did you hide the truth from me? That you might pierce the veil yourself. Like any task, knowledge precedes action. Information learned is more valuable than information given. Besides, your recent behavior had not inspired much confidence. I see. Altair, your mission has not changed. Merely the context within which you perceive it. And armed with this knowledge, I might better understand those Templars that remain. Is there anything else you want to know? What about the treasure Malik retrieved from Solomon's temple? Robert seemed desperate to have it back. In time, Altair, all will become clear. Just as the role of the Templars has revealed itself to you, so too will the nature of their treasure. For now, take comfort in the fact that it is not in their hands, but ours. If this is your desire, it is. You are restored another rank. Take back your weapon. 
Use it to bring honor to the Brotherhood. Altair, before you go... Yes? How did you know I wouldn't kill you? Truth be told, Master, I didn't. I took a leap of faith. Cool, we got our cool sword back, yep. Or extra throwing knives, I guess. Alright, so... Um, I don't think... How many throwing knives have we got now? Oh, I can't. Okay, let me tell me. Alright, and we've got no training to do, so we can just go straight up to... I What's going on? Aka, What's I think. Stop. All right, so I'm guessing yeah, I have to go to that one. Anyway, guys, I'm going to end this episode here for today, and in the next one, we are going to do the three investigations we need to do, and then assassinate our target. If you want to catch up with me or see anything else going on with the channel, make sure to follow me on my Twitter, which is on the screen in front of you or in the description down below, and I'll see you guys in the next episode.